Bratton. You've uh, been blessed today by this service. I know you have, and we've given, and we've heard the word of the Lord. And again, to our young people, we are excited about this school year for you and what the Lord uh, is going to do for you in this academic year as you go back to school. But just before we close out today, we do want to give space to our pastor and our first lady who are going to come in to greet our church and to even extend a special prayer for all of our students and for all of our teachers, for all those who are preparing to begin this academic school year. We want to let you know that we love you. Faith, Hope, and Charity, would you do me a favor this week? Would you reach out to a young person from Faith, Hope, and Charity this week? Would you reach out to one of them? If you've got their number, text them. If you got to go through their parent call, text, send an email, but reach out to them and, and share some word of encouragement with them. Young people, would you do this for me? Would you reach out to some older young person this week and, and love on them? Just let them know. Is I know we've been doing virtual for a minute, but just reach out to them and, and spend some time with them, even on the phone or through text by email. But let's receive right now our pastor and first lady as they come to share in this back to school prayer and this greeting to you on this afternoon. Come on, put your hands together and give God some praise. Come on, bless the Lord. Come on, you can do better than that. Come on, after a powerful message. Come on, come on, come on. A turn church. See, a turn church will be a praiser. We'll be a worshiper. Come on, give him some glory. Lord, I want to thank you. As you're sending your kids out, a turn church will be praying right now. Hallelujah. Glory, glory. We thank the Lord for the man of God for coming and speaking to our hearts. And as the elder just stated, he went through all the generations. He hit us all. Yeah, all of us should have probably picked up our feet and held them up off the ground because we could have been saying ouch for some of the things that were being said, letting us know the turn church. But one words, a few words that he said that really stuck in my heart. He says, what about you? What about us? What about us? Then he also says, but then I met Jesus. <laughs> Lord, have mercy. That did it for me. That set me on fire. But then, of all the things that I've been through, all the mess that I've done, everything that I've turned my back on, all the names that I can remember that had nothing to do with biblical names and everything, but then <laughs> I met Jesus. And that made the difference. I thank the Lord for that message today. And we're so grateful today for each and every one joining in by whatever means, Zoom, through our streaming audience, through YouTube, whatever. We're grateful for how you took the time out to be with faith, hope, and charity. Now we're going to have prayer for our young people, our children, our students that are going off, and then I will close out speaking to parents and to our teachers who are on the battlefield. First Lady will lead us off. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Lord God, we give you glory. Thank you. We give you praise. We give you honor, God. Thank you me. are great, and yeah. you are greatly to be yeah. praised from the rising of the sun till the going down of the sand. Yes. God, we honor you on today. God, we lift you up high and mighty. God, you are great and you are worthy. We love you on today, God. There is none like you, God. You are God all by yourself. You don't need nobody else, God. We say hallelujah, God glory hallelujah god we bless you we love you god oh god on today we cry out for our children god as they are returning back into the classrooms god oh god have mercy on them and camp your angels round about them god protect them on every side from the hand of the enemy from the child molester from the bully lord god from someone who would hurt them. Lord God, we pray right now that you would let your blood just cover them from the top of their head to the heel of their feet, God. God, we place them in your hands, God. We're leaning and dependent on you, God. We ask you to protect them, to cover them all around, Lord God. You see the enemy, Lord God, is out to harm, Lord God even with this COVID, Lord God. And then they want our children back in the classroom. 
Oh, God, we pray right now, God, that you would cover them with your love, with your blood on every side, God. Hallelujah, Lord Jesus. We pray right now that you would even help them, Lord God, in their studies and their academics, God. We're praying for straight A's. We're praying for honor roll students, Lord God. Those that need help, we pray right now that you would provide the help that they need with their tutors and those who are willing to spend that extra time with them on the in the name of Jesus, Lord God. We pray right now for each and every one, Lord God, as they go to and fro on the bus, across the walkways, Lord God. We've been praying for the teachers, Lord God, and the health care workers, Lord Jesus, the, even the substitute teachers, the principals, the administrative staff, Lord God, the janitors, everyone who has contact with our children. Lord God, we pray right now that you would uphold them on every side, Lord God, protect them. Oh God, we can't ask you enough to protect our children. Lord Jesus, let your blood cover them. We place them in your hands, God. We give this to you. This is our request to you throughout this school year. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen and amen, amen. Hallelujah. And to the parents, come on, hallelujah. We ask right now, Lord God, that you look down upon that mother, that father. Lord God, that single family. Lord, that one parent household, Lord God. Lord God, right now we ask that you prepare them, Lord God, for what they're about to meet as their children go out that door. Lord God, right now we ask that you prepare their children as they go out that door for prayer. Lord God, the mothers and fathers, Lord. Lord, give them wisdom as they deal with their children, Lord. Give them that opportunity, Lord, to, to sit down, Lord God, to speak life to them, Lord. Let them know that there's a turn church. There's a group of people, Lord, a church, a body of people that care for them. Lord God, in the name of Jesus, we rebuke every spirit that's not of thee. Have your way in their life, Lord God. Let that mother be the mother, and let that father be the father of fathers, Lord. But of all, Lord, let them look to the hills from which cometh their help, knowing that their help cometh from the Lord. Lord God, we ask right now, we send out angels, we dispatch them to households, Lord God, to make a difference in the house right now. Lord God, as they go out tomorrow on Monday, Lord, to schools, Lord God, Lord, for those that have already started it, Lord. We right now ask, Lord God, that you encamp those angels round about them, Lord. Uh, protect them, Lord. God, right now do a miraculous thing in every school, Lord God, out there. In every classroom out there, Lord. In every home out there, Lord. Lord God, make a change in the lives of each and every one. Lord God, you said, whatever we ask in prayer, Lord God, all we got to do is believe. And we're believing right now, Lord, that you're hearing our cry. Lord God, make a change right now. Lord God, because we are turned church. Uh, and Lord God, we believe that our prayer is going forth and with power and conviction. Lord God, we're so grateful to you. We give you all the praise today. We lift up holy voices to you. Lord God, knowing that you are the author and the finisher of our faith. Uh, Lord God, right now, move in a miraculous way right now in this place, Lord. In this place right now, Lord God, we say unto you, now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only God, our wise God, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power for now and ever. And all God's people say amen and amen. And God bless you until we meet again. Have a wonderful week. And students, have a wonderful year. And let your light shine. Bring all those A's home. Hallelujah. God bless you. In Jesus' mighty name.